Hello, hello, hello! OMG! Welcome back to my channel. So, so excited you are here. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. I appreciate you. It's Jody Dunn. And I'm coming at you with my CVS haul because today is a Monday. And I love to go to CVS on Mondays and snag some amazing deals. I definitely decided to do some different things today because let me know if you ever feel like this. Like, I get bored. I get bored picking up the same thing every day, every single week. Listen, if it's a moneymaker, I will almost always pick it up. I feel like, here, let me pick it up. Uh, but sometimes I gotta get, I gotta keep myself excited. And so I decided to do some different things today, um, which I knew would result in me not having a freebie haul or a moneymaker haul, and I was totally fine with that. So I'm super excited to share this one with you. If you are new and you just found the channel, I'm so happy that you are here. Would you please say hello to me and let me know that you are new right down there so I can welcome you to the channel and say hello back to you. And if you are already subscribed, thank you so much for coming back to another video. I appreciate you. Let me know if you are doing any CVS shopping this week or what deals you are excited about. The big guy is not behind me. He is in the other room. So I'll try to get a shot of him before we get to the kitchen table for our debrief and to go over our receipts. I wanted to share something with you because I got offended the other day which doesn't happen to me very often. I, I'm pretty good most of the time at learning how to filter through things because so much of our lives now is um, digital. And when you're reading a comment or a text message or things like that, you can't see a person's body language. You can't hear tone of voice. So I always keep that in my mind before I jump to conclusions. But my friend, Jen Acosta, who I have talked about on this channel before, highly recommend you go follow her over on Instagram. She's actually a life coach. She's freaking amazing. I love her. If you're looking for somebody that posts constant inspiration, constant ways to grow yourself and, and like fix our minds, because our minds always play tricks on us, and uh, anyways, go follow her. But she posted this quote the other day and I was so grateful for this quote that she posted because it happened to me and it made me get offended for one little quick second. And then I remembered this quote and I was like, yep, okay, Jody. Nope, we're not gonna get offended by this. So I wanna read you this quote and then I'll tell you a little bit of what I got offended and how this quote really helped me. Um, so the quote says, heal. So you can hear what's being said without the filter of your own wounds. Whoa, powerful. Because no matter what is coming at us in life, we always interpret it through the lens of our past wounds, of our past experiences. Even if it's not the intention of the other person, we still filter it through those things. So when I got offended, I remembered that quote and always I share things in hopes that it may help you because there's no question in my mind that we all do this or have done this in the past. So somebody left a comment on one of my videos and um, you know, I get nasty comments here or there, whatever. It's totally fine. It's part of putting yourself out there and creating content. It absolutely doesn't bother me in the least bit because I understand that that person leaving a nasty comment, their comment has nothing to do with me and everything to do with them and the character that they have and the unhappiness they have. So I totally understand that and it doesn't bother me at all. This comment wasn't about me, it was about somebody that I love very much. And it did, it offended me for one quick second. And then I said, Jody, remember Jen's quote. First of all, ask yourself, why is that comment, why did it offend you? Okay, I got it. Now I know why it offended me. And what were, what were their intentions? And what basically had happened was this person took something that I had said 
in a video and totally misinterpreted it and basically put the meaning behind this, what I had said into their own filter because of their own life experiences, because of their own wounds. And so I recognized that right away and totally was not offended any longer. So I wanted to share that with you because if you ever find yourself in a situation where maybe you are interpreting things through your own filters and your past wounds that somebody else said that that was not their intent, um, maybe this will help you to, to be able to step back and say, okay, wait a second. Or if the same situation happened to you where somebody took something you said and totally twisted it and made up a story about it that wasn't even real because of their own filters, this will help you understand maybe why they did that. So there you go. Wanted to share that with you just in hopes that it would help you. Uh, we're getting dang close to 18,000 subscribers. So you know a new gift card giveaway is coming. But in the meantime, I feel like doing a gift card giveaway today. So I'm going to give away a $10 CVS e-gift card which means it will be electronic. It will be sent to your email because I can buy it quick and send it right to you versus having to go to the post office and mailing it and you having to wait to get it. So all you got to do to enter into the giveaway is make sure you are subscribed to the channel. If the subscribe button is red, which I believe is right there, make sure you hit that. If you enjoy my content, of course, you're not going to subscribe if you don't. And give the video a thumbs up. I appreciate you always for doing that. And leave me a comment down below. Since this is a CVS video and I am giving away a CVS gift card, uh, tell me what your favorite CVS deal is this week. All right, let's head into the store and see what we are going to pick up today. And of course, we will go over uh, my receipts at the kitchen table. Let's get to it. All right, here we are at the Red Box. I always grab a product right by the Red Box, scan it, and print the label just to make sure there's paper in the machine because I've had it where there was no paper before, and that's a pain. <laughs> so there's a little tip for you that a cashier had given me a long time ago. So let's get these coupons and do some dang shopping today. All right, the easy freebie of the week. No coupons even needed. It's going to be on the Sure and the Brute. I don't even know if my store carries Brute. I've never even looked for it. But the Sure deodorant is on sale for $2. And when you buy one, you earn back a $2 extra buck. If you're just starting at CVS this week, this is a really easy deal to do. All right, we're going to do some oral care deals, but something totally different than what we usually get. Because I like to mix things up and just excite myself. <laughs> So we're going to go ahead and get the um, Crest. It's like a whitening mouthwash. It's on sale for $4.99. When you buy one, you earn back a $2 extra buck. And the deal is a limit of two. So I'm going to go ahead and grab two of them. And I have two $1 paper coupons off of this mouthwash that just came in our PNG inserts. All right, this deal comes around a few times a year. So I'm going to take advantage of it today. Uh, it is on the battery-operated toothbrushes. They are on sale for $6.99. And the deal is when you buy two, you earn back a $4 extra buck. So I'm going to grab two of these battery-operated toothbrushes. So now the total I have for these four products is $11.96. No, it is not. It is $23.96. I'm going to go ahead and use two of the $2 off the battery operated toothbrush coupons out of the same PNG. I have a $2 CRT off any Crest um, that I sent to my card, and I have this four off 20 CRT. So that'll bring me down to 11.96, earning back eight in extra bucks. So final cost of 99 cents each. All right, this is a deal that is not advertised in the ad, but it is going on. Uh, when you buy one Gillette or Venus razor, you earn back a $5 extra buck. So I'm gonna grab these. I can't believe my store had stock after last week's sale. It's $9.99. I'm going to use a $3 paper coupon off of this. Yes, it expired. Yes, my store takes expired coupons. And I have this four off of 10 Gillette uh, CRT. That'll bring me down to $2.99, earning back a $5 extra buck, making this free plus a $2.01 moneymaker, and that's going to help me pay for my toothbrushes that I wanted. All right, we're going to look at the Nivea deal. Um, I have a rebate on Ibotta. 
my store does not carry the aftershave products and I don't feel like going to the unhelpful store today. So I'm just gonna go ahead and grab these. They are on sale. No, they're regularly priced for $4.99 each. And they are buy two, earn back a $5 extra buck. And included in this deal is like the lotion and the body wash and things like that. So these two total me $9.98. I'm gonna use this two off two paper coupon the two, I have a two off eight Nivea CRT, so that will bring me down to $7.98. I'll earn back a $5 extra buck, a uh, $1.20 for each one on Ibotta, plus I have a bonus for 75 cents. So these are gonna be free plus a two seventeen dollars moneymaker. All right, let's move on to some moneymaker hair care because I need it uh, to help me pay for my spend 30, get 10, which is not gonna be a freebie, but it's products I want. So we're gonna first look at the L'Oreal Ever Pure which are regularly priced and on promotion for, I think it's spend 15, earn five, or it might be buy two, earn five. I'll pop it up on the screen, but I'm gonna go ahead and grab two of these. I'm gonna grab these moisture. I've never tried these. Let me know if you have tried the L'Oreal Ever Pure before. And then I'm gonna add in that mix, the uh, Tresemme deal. We got some new Tresemmes. These are on a separate promotion. I'm not gonna grab these today, but very interested in these. The regular bottles are on sale two for nine, and when you buy two, you earn back a $2 extra buck. So total I have in hair care now is $25.58. I have a $1 digital off the Tresemme that will most likely glitch with this $4 off two paper coupon. I'm also going to use a printable coupon that I printed through my Swagbucks link so I get paid. Uh, for $5 off two of the L'Oreal Everpure, I also have a $5 digital that will glitch. And I have this $3 off when you buy two Tresemme CRT and a four off 18 hair care CRT. That's gonna bring me down to 358, earning back $7 in extra bucks, making these this hair care free, plus a 342 moneymaker, and it all tracks towards beauty. All right, we are gonna move on to the spend 30, earn $10 in extra bucks. And I'm gonna do something totally different because I just get really tired of picking up the same products, especially if it's things I don't need. I just can't buy Pantene right now. I can't buy Herbal Essence right now. So I'm gonna pick up some different things. This one right here is gonna be just a product that we actually need. Um, I am all out of size one of the Always Infinity, and they are part of this deal. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab, um, these are my girl's favorites too. Have you ever tried these Always Infinities? They really, really like these. So they're $9.79, buy one, get one half price. So these two will total me $14.68. I am gonna go ahead and use the $3 off two paper coupon that did expire. I also have a $1 digital that will most likely glitch with it. And I have this two off 10, always pads CRT. And I'm gonna be a little over actually $30 on this deal. Um, but again, they're just products that I actually don't have that I really wanted to grab. So I'm looking for some Vicks Medicine, which is part of this deal. And I couldn't find the one I wanted. So I'm gonna go ahead and settle for these. Um, they're cold and flu pills. I really wanted the liquid one, um, but they are all on sale for $9.99 and included in on this deal. And then as I was pulling out the coupons I'm going to use to show you, I realized the coupons do not match this product. So guess who's heading to the unhelpful store anyways, because I really wanted those ding liquid ones. So there you go. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put back the um, Nivea products and see if they have the uh, shave balm at the unhelpful store, because my rebate is $2.50 versus $1.20. So this will be everything I'm grabbing. Let's walk into the unhelpful store and look at that. Right as I'm going to the cold and flu aisle, there they are, the ones that I wanted. They are priced at $11.99, but they are on sale this week, even though the store is not tagged, for $9.99. So I'm gonna grab the uh, Vicks Flu Therapy, the nighttime one, and I grabbed a daytime one, and I'm gonna use two of these $2 off coupons off of these. And I have a $3 off when you spend 18 on Cold Remedies CRT that I sent to my card. 
So now for my spend 30, earn 10, I'm at 34.66. After all coupons and CRTs, that'll bring me down to 21.66, earning back a $10 extra buck. So final cost will be $2.90 for each package of those always pads in each one of these VIX flu therapy. All right, let's take a look at the Nivea deal. Um, this store has all of the products, but when I did the math, um, it wasn't going to be a moneymaker, even with a higher rebate. So here we go. I'm going to go ahead and grab the, the shave gel at this store for $4.99. So same deal that I showed you at the other store. I'm going to use one paper coupon for $2 off of two and a $2 off eight Nivea CRT. I'll get back $1.20 from Ibotta for each one and a 75 cent bonus, making them a $2.17 money maker. All right, so this is gonna complete my first CVS haul, much smaller than I normally do, but I got some products that I really, really wanted to get. So let's get to the kitchen table and go over these receipts and see how we ended up. in a way. My little Gus for any y'all that like to see him. All right, we are back at the kitchen table with this small CVS haul. We got some great products here that I'm super excited to share with you. So what you're looking at is $106.17 worth of products and I always just give you the sale prices not the regular retail prices. So I did I did have to go to the dang unhelpful store. I really wanted those. Like I really wanted the liquid. Um, I don't know. It's basically a preventative thing. I feel like when I'm prepared, things don't happen. <laughs> when I'm unprepared, things happen. Like getting sick. And then get, having to go to the dang store and pay him full price for cold medicine. So that is something I have none of. And so I really wanted it. So there you go. So in my first transaction, I did everything except for the Nivea and the VIX flu therapy. Because I did that at the unhelpful store. So let's take a look at my receipt. So there is my Tresemme at 249. There is my Sure deodorant. Uh, there is the mouthwash for $4.99. That stuff is $7.29 each. And those are the little bottles, 16 point, 16 fluid ounces, officers. Um, there's my battery operated toothbrushes, two of them at $6.99. There's my always pads at $9.79 and buy one, get one half price. Super excited. I think the store only had two of the size ones. Uh, the L'Oreal Everpure for $8.29 each and then the Gillette Eraser. So used all those coupons that I showed you in the store, including the 5 off 2 printable. Look what glitched. I knew it would because I know how the glitch works. Uh, so there it is. And then my $1 Tresemme coupon glitched along with my $1 Always coupon. Used all the CRTs that I showed you in the store. And then I used um, $28 in extra bucks to pay for this. Had a subtotal of $1.21, which went on my gift card. I earned back $4 for the Crest. Um, $4 for, or that was for the battery operated toothbrushes. That was for the mouthwash. $5 for the Gillette. $2 for the Sure Deodorant. $2 for the Tresemme. And $5 for the Ever Pure. And then, as always, you can see on my receipt, it was tracking my always purchase towards my spend 30, get 10. You do not have to do the purchases all in one transaction. It will track it. You have the whole entire week. Isn't that awesome that CVS does that? So then I found my VIX flu therapy that I wanted. So there you go. They were on sale for $9.99 each and ended up picking up both the same Nivea pretty much because the one with a higher rebate on Ibotta was going to be a cost of like 25 cents where these were a money maker. So used my two coupons off of the VIX and my $2 off of two off the Nivea. There's my three off 18 cold remedy CRT and my two off eight Nivea. I used $18 in extra bucks to pay. Had a sub total of 96 cents and I earned back my $10 for spending 30 and then I earned back $5 for Nivea. So what I used total was $46 in extra bucks to pay for this, plus had subtotals of $2.17. Um, 
which means all of this product cost us $48.17. I earned back $37 in extra bucks that I just showed you. I spent $25, just over $25 in beauty, which my whole beauty pro um, purchase today was just the hair care. But I only needed, I needed like just $5, yeah. No, $4.62 to hit beauty. So I will earn back another $3 in beauty bucks. So that makes uh, $40 is what I earned. Plus submitted my receipt to Ibotta and received back $3.15 for the Nivea. $1.20 for each one of them plus the $0.75 cent bonus. And I did submit my receipt to pggoodeveryday.com so that I could earn back um, the points towards gift cards. So earned 250 points on one receipt and 100 points on the second receipt, which is equivalent to $2 towards gift cards. So that makes my final cost $3.02 for all of these products. I was so excited about that because the spend 30, earn 10 was really what I was going for. And I know it's a totally different spend 30, earn 10 than you've probably seen anybody else do. I just cannot buy the same products every single week. I will get so bored and I don't have a need for them. I just did a big donation to the shelter and I still have Pantene left. <laughs> I just can't do it. And it wouldn't have been a moneymaker. I was going to pick up some laundry products, but um, like I said, totally out of size one of the Always Infinity. And so I definitely wanted to grab some of those. And then I thought, let me just get this because I really want that. So there you go. That's what I got for you today. I would love to hear what deals you're picking up. I hope you decide to enter into the gift card giveaway. And uh, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you. I'm going to see you again soon.